Hey, Milmo Maggins. I thought I'd just do a quick uh, unboxing uh, and look at these Joy-Con wheels from Best Buy. Insignia's like Best Buy's house brand, I guess. Um, I'll just open them up. We'll see how the color matches the Joy-Cons. The picture on the box makes it look like it's a dead-on match with the Joy-Cons, and we'll see. So... Pop them open here, pull them out. It's a two pack, and that's pretty cool. It was only 10 bucks at Best Buy. Um, so, cheaper than the two pack official Nintendo ones that are just like gray or black. Um, let's just pop a Joy Con in there and see. Wow. Actually, mm, that pop in right. That is not too bad. <laughs> wow. Huh. That's kind of cool. Look at that. And these buttons, the shoulder buttons, uh, real squishy. There's a lot of play in them. Uh, moves down quite a distance there, I don't know, five millimeters or something. Um, probably more than five millimeters. Anyway, that's kind of cool. It makes them feel like analog buttons, which of course they are not. The light in there is going, but there's no window that shows you which, which player you would be. Here's the uh, blue one. That's kind of cool. I actually like these. I actually hated the Wii and uh, Wii U steering wheels for Mario Kart. Um, did not like them. Let's mix and match here. Huh. Well, there you go. I kind of like these. For 10 bucks, that's a pretty good deal. Uh, I don't know if it's just Best Buy selling these. I know Insignia is only at Best Buy. I don't know if there's other brands that have colored... Uh, Joy-Con wheels like this, but I really like that. That's not so bad. Anyway, that's it. I approve. Maybe I'll post some updated info after I've played a bunch of uh, Mario Kart Deluxe with my kids. Um, and tell you how they do. Really, I, I don't like motion controls on Mario Kart, but we've only got two sets of Joy-Cons and um, and one pro controller, so somebody's got to be on motion controls if we're going to have four people, if that makes sense to you. Um, I don't know if they fit super tight. They seem to be popping out a little bit. I'm just cleaning that with some alcohol. Anyway, that's... That doesn't look as cool. Oh, and look at that. There's some play left and right. So maybe it's trickier than I thought to lock these in place. Huh. Looks like there's a hole here and a hole here for, depending on if you put in the left or right Joy-Con, the uh, button on the Joy-Con. Presumably this button right here lines up with this hole. So, I guess that's what you want to aim for, to make sure it's positioned right. But there's no button to push it out, or it doesn't really lock in. Uh, yeah, see that? Maybe that's locked in place now. I guess so. It takes a little bit of fiddling to get it in place right. Yeah, I'd say just push it in there and then move it side to side until it kind of clicks in better. And then it's in place okay. I'll put them back to the matching uh, setup. That, I'm surprised that the colors match so well. Hmm. Pretty good purchase, I think, for 10 bucks. Anyway, that's it. Bye.